welcome to the International Innovation Awards 2020. A very good evening to each and every one of you. I'm Nadia Hing and I will be your Master of Ceremony for today's celebration in recognizing outstanding innovations across the globe. Welcome to the International Innovation Awards 2020. We are glad to be here and to have a full house today with audiences streaming in from all over the region, including Belgium, Brazil, Cambodia, China, Hong Kong, Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore, Taiwan, Thailand, the Philippines, Turkey, United Arab Emirates, Vietnam, and other parts of the globe. Welcome everybody. Also, do let us know in the live comment section which country are you streaming in from? Officially welcoming in the award ceremony together with us are the Board of Advisors and Executive Committee of Enterprise Asia, including Tansri Dr. Fong Chan An, Chairman of Enterprise Asia. A very good evening, sir. Richard Sung, President of Enterprise Asia. Hello, Richard. Along with the Board of Advisors, Governor Gwendolyn Garcia, Dr. Eugene Chen, Tansri Ahmad Fuzi Haji Abdul Razak, Lieutenant General Sudhir Sharma, Dr. Victor Wee, and last but not least, Dr. Shaika Al Maskari. We are here tonight to celebrate and honor remarkable breakthrough innovations that inspire revolutionary transformation. For more than 10 years now, Enterprise Asia as the region's largest and leading non-governmental multilateral organization for entrepreneurs and enterprises, this award aims to blend together leading entrepreneurs across the region to spur greater innovation, fair business practices, and growth in entrepreneurship. Each year, the International Innovation Awards determines its theme color by carrying out extensive research into trends that are influencing the social and economic development. This year, the theme of the awards is the color white, which aligns with its purpose of promoting transparency. We've seen the unprecedented global change, and now is the time for change, to start embracing and promoting transparency by demonstrating an open sharing of information and accountability at all levels. So, let us all join hands to build a transparent world. Now, ladies and gentlemen, for you who are new to Enterprise Asia, over the past 13 years, we have grown to become one of the largest multilateral associations for entrepreneurs and enterprises. Our mission at Enterprise Asia is to really champion fair and equitable entrepreneurship development in the region. At the heart of this mission is our desire to democratize entrepreneurship, empower innovation, and institutionalize sustainability. Three very important enablers if we are to create equality and equity in business, in entrepreneurship, and in nation building. So with that, allow me to direct your attention to the screen as we play you a short introduction of Enterprise Asia. At Enterprise Asia, our three pillars of purpose is entrepreneurship, sustainability, and innovation. The past 10 years has been a wonderful journey of empowering entrepreneurs matching them with opportunities and seeing them grow. We work with governments and other organizations to democratize entrepreneurship by promoting competition and choice. We believe that the true foundation of any nation's economy lies in its entrepreneurial resources, which, if nurtured effectively, 
can be the most efficacious asset for sustainable economic development. Together, we aim to uplift the economic status of people across the region to ensure a legacy of hope and innovation for our children. Our network of more than 8,000 entrepreneurs and enterprises across the world presents a combined revenue of over U.S. $50 billion. Our analysts regularly monitor close to 200,000 businesses across 24 countries and 32 different industries. We aim to identify and recognize outstanding entrepreneurial achievement and in innovative enterprises as a means to rewards and encourages innovative businesses and responsible enterprises to rise up to a standard of business that prioritizes innovation and sustainability. Our global summits such as the Enterprise Asia Summit, International CSR Summit, and the International Innovation Summit set the global agenda on our three pillars, namely democratizing entrepreneurship, institutionalizing sustainability, and empowering innovation. The next 10 years will be about connecting businesses to the innovation ecosystem and ensuring that sustainability is ingrained into everything they do. Join us as we strive towards building a world that is rich in sustainable entrepreneurship and innovation. Now, without further ado, may we welcome Mr. Richard Sung, Enterprise Asia's president, to present his opening address. Let's welcome him. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Enterprise Asia, I would like to welcome all of you to the International Innovation Awards 2020. The safety and well-being of participants is of paramount importance to us, which is why this year's award is being presented virtually. Through this innovative and engaging virtual platform, we trust that the awards will be pleasing for all participants. Enterprise Asia's objective is to spearhead an innovation revolution a movement which aims to create an innovation ecosystem for enterprises. Through this movement, we hope to inspire innovation in all enterprises across all industries so that ultimately they can contribute to the progress of society. For me, it is an honor to be conveying this message to all recipients of the InnoQuip Award. All of you have strived to improve the human experience by making each product, each service, and each person better, one step at a time. Each year, a color is selected to reflect the major macro topics that we wish to highlight to the world. This year, we have selected white, the color of transparency. Transparency builds trust, and trust is the foundation for great teamwork, relationships, and loyalty. I would like to point out that now is the time for change and it starts with embracing and promoting transparency. You may also notice that the UNOCUBE is white and now you understand why. If anything, the pandemic has highlighted to business leaders and organizations the need to develop new ideas and innovate so as to respond to existing or emerging needs. While most organizations may see restructuring and repurposing as a short-term opportunity or solution, it remains a fundamental survival strategy and growth opportunity for economies and industries around the world. Today, we have witnessed how the pandemic has created a wave of change across the region, and innovation has played a central role during this crisis in adjusting the world's greatest challenges. At this point, an organization's survival and success are no longer dependent on improving effectiveness and efficiency, but rather on its ability to devise strategies and develop capabilities for moving towards new opportunities to innovate. Innovation is no longer a luxury. Innovation has to be a core part of an organization's DNA, enabling is to adapt quickly and ensure business growth and future relevance. Having said that, 
A time of crisis is also a time of opportunity. Crisis demands movement and change. The pace of ideation, decision making, and implementation all have to increase dramatically. Taken together, I hope that all prominent entrepreneurs and organizations here tonight have made the most of the opportunities that the current crisis has presented to test the different thinking, to learn, and to move forward in sort to innovate. Once again, our best wishes to all the recipients of this year's International Innovation Awards. I hope that everyone will enjoy tonight's ceremony as we highlight the innovations and innovators behind them and celebrate everything that they represent. Thank you. Thank you very, very much, Richard, for that incredible opening speech. I know we are all very eager to find out who the winners of the International Innovation Awards in this very memorable year of COVID-19. But before we do so, allow me time to acknowledge and to thank our partners who have all made this evening possible. The Australian Chamber of Commerce in Vietnam, British Chamber of Commerce Singapore, Malaysian Chamber of Commerce Hong Kong and Macau Limited, Malaysian Investment Development Authority, National Institute of Entrepreneurship and Innovation, Cambodia, Singapore Business Federation, Singapore National Employers Federation, Singapore Indian Chamber of Commerce and Industry, Singapore Malay Chamber of Commerce and Industry, and Avangardia Group Sindirian Burhad, the official production partner. We would also like to thank our media partners for making this event successful. PR Newswire, IIA's news release distribution partner. Asian NGO. Business World, the Philippines. Commercial Times, Taiwan. Esquire, Philippines. Hong Kong Economic Times. Kumparan, Indonesia. SME Magazine, The Asian Entrepreneur, and lastly, The Nation, Thailand. Ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've been waiting for is here. We shall now begin presenting the awards to tonight's recipients. The International Innovation Awards recognizes outstanding innovations in the categories of product, service and solution, and organization and culture with the goal to encourage organizations to continue investing in innovations. The International Innovation Award recipients have all gone through an initial screening, audit verification and scorecarding process by the panel of judges before being selected from among hundreds of nominees as winners tonight. Judges compromise of a panel of innovation experts and thought leaders, while scoring is done using the proprietary IIA 8D benchmark. Before we begin, give yourselves a big round of applause for your exceptional commitment to engaging and empowering innovation. Also, remember to like and share this live video with your friends and family. Now, we shall begin with the first session of the awards presentation. Ladies and gentlemen, we would now like to present to you the first award category, the product category. Measurement parameters for this category include innovation distinction, practicality and performance, commercial viability, and social and economic impact. the recipients of the product category of the International Innovation Awards 2020 in alphabetical order of their company names are... First, we have Be Rich Thailand Company Limited from Thailand with their product Vitara Anti Melasma Spot Serum. Let's have a look at their video.
Buffalo Machinery Company Limited from Taiwan with their product, Axile Intelligent Automation. It is great honor to receive this award. Big thanks to Enterprise Asia in recognizing Axile Digital Intelligent Automation. Digital Intelligent Automation support the machine operation in much better reliability and good to work under 24-7 mode. That's why Axile Digital Intelligent Automation is the update solution for manufacturing and ensure the client stay competitive and more profitable. Next, we have iPower Products Limited from Hong Kong with their product 360 degree far infrared radiant electric pendant heater with light. Let's take a look at their video. We are very honored and excited to be awarded the International Innovation Award for my new heater, which has been granted in invention patents in various parts of the world. Our heater includes remote control and timer to operate individually two semicircular metallic inkline heating elements set on each side of the heater to provide warmth on demand to either side of the heater and in open door and open window settings so that the user can simply enjoy the fresh clean air and sleep comfortably at night under our heater especially during COVID-19 pandemic. Our heater is for directional localized heating and comprises a specially designed metallic reflector positioned in the focal zones of the heating elements that reflect optimal fine fit rate rays so as to provide the user with warmth and energy savings in an environmentally friendly manner. A separately functioning LED lamp bulb is positioned between the heating elements to provide light on demand. We would like to take this opportunity to congratulate our design team for winning this exceptional award. And moving on, we have Money Save Malaysia, Cindy Rian Berhad from Malaysia with their product P2P crowdfunding platform, Money Save. Incorporated from Taiwan and their product, a noble antibody drug conjugate OB999. OBI999 is a complete cell phone. It is a very good thing. It is a very good 
。OBI 九九九是第一个针对 Global H 所设计的 ADC 药物。动物实验已经证实 ，OBI 九九九对多种癌症都有显著的效果。台湾浩力。是一家多元化的癌症新药研发公司，我们以癌症免疫疗法的领航者自诩。我们期待 OBI 九九九能早日成功，能帮助人们改善健康，创造新。Another winner from Thailand is Polyplex Thailand Public Company Limited with their product R Pet Fill. Let's have a look at their showcase. We at Polyplex are actively making efforts in the direction of circular economy. One of the steps in this direction has been successfully developing and launching our product, our pet film. The our pet film, thus produced from this our pet resin, has the same physical and mechanical properties as those of a normal pet film. Additionally. The process of glycolysis is an EFSA compiled recycling process for food packaging applications. With our R Pet film, we have applied the three R's concept of reduce, reuse, and recycle, with the same quality and properties as the pet film from the conventional process. R Pet film provides an alternative with a practical reduction of societal and environmental impact. TCL Electronics Holdings Limited from China with their product TCL QLED Android TV C815. Public Company Limited from Thailand with their product Bean Vermicelli Double Dragon Balance DD Balance. To a food, I think one of the most important thing is that it's got a very, very long runway for the next 10, 20, 30 years. If you think about the total amount of food supply that's going to come in the next 10 years, a lot of it will actually come from Southeast Asia. Uh, consumers today they are demanding different types of food, whether it's uh, carbohydrate, proteins, fibers, its ingredients. So I think a lot of the future of the food is really about you know providing long-term supply to export to the rest of the world. So we think about the future of food as connecting the value chain from farm to shelf. We work very closely with over 10,000 farmers in Southeast Asia region, producing all kinds of tapioca and tapioca-related food products. We think of innovation probably in typically the cycles for food innovation are slightly longer. So you're looking at six months, nine months, 12 months. So we have to develop projects with different types of project life cycle to make sure that we're developing new innovation for our customers. And up next, we have TOGL Technologies, Cindy Renferhat from Malaysia with their product, Yippee. Winning the International Innovation Award 2020 was the icing on the cake for what has been exceptionally busy year for Yippee. We are proud of the determination and dedication of our employee. To be recognized for our achievement at a regional level is a credit for each and every one of our staff. And we will continue to provide more platform for content creator and one-stop solution for SME without compromising our value proposition. Last, we are very grateful to the judges for presenting us with this award. Thank you.
On a Monday morning, you wake up feeling tired. You launch Yippee and you play the sound of quantum nutrition. Reply your mum. Get ready to work. You listen to Tea Shield music. Then you start your daily task with Tea Shield that protects you from EMF radiation, which uses quantum pulses to support mental balance that helps release stress. Finally, you listen to sleep enhancement music and eventually fall asleep. Yippee, your daily essential app. And moving on is Top Club Corporation Burhat from Malaysia with their product, Finesis. Burhad from Malaysia with their product Top Grip Thermoplastic Elastomer TPE Glove. Achieving their third award is Top Glove Corporation Burhad from Malaysia with their product Top Eco Rubber. Using a chemo-mechanical reclaiming technique which utilizes their very own formulated reclaiming chemicals, Top Glove Corporation Burhad converts rejected nitrile gloves into value-added rubber products such as rubber gaskets with an aim towards a sustainable initiative with zero wastage. Besides that, by operating at low temperatures, well below 100 degrees Celsius, it also prevents the evaporation of harmful gases such as, but not limited to sulfur dioxide, sulfur trioxide, and chlorine during the reclaiming process. And with that, congratulations to all the winners Give yourselves a big, big round of applause. And don't forget to comment in the live chat box to congratulate all your fellow winners. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you are enjoying yourselves so far. What is an award ceremony without a world-class performance, right? Well, let me give you a brief introduction before we hear from him. He is a blind and autistic musical prodigious savant. His amazing gift lies within his musical expression, perfect pitch and a passion for all forms of music. With his audio photographic memory, he can recall music he hears after just one listen. That's pretty impressive. Last year, his performance did not only pull the judges' heartstrings by earning the golden buzzer, but also America's standing ovation crowning him as 2019's America's Got Talent winner. So
So, let's take a look at this short introductory video about him. Cody was born with optic nerve hypoplasia, a visual disorder that has rendered him legally blind. At the age of four, Cody was diagnosed with autism, and he also suffers from Addison's disease, a potentially life-threatening condition caused when the adrenal glands don't produce enough of the hormone cortisol. Cody's conditions impact how he processes emotions and can cause him to be hyperactive and emotionally reactive. Having a child with special needs is, you know, <laughs> you, you have these moments in life where you hit a wall, you don't know where, you know, your child's gonna end up. Yet, despite these disadvantages, put him in front of a keyboard and Cody turns into a musical genius. He has all these talents, but he has trouble communicating, his mother said. He used to tantrum like 30 times a day. After he started performing, he got it. It really helped us to get his autism under control. He wants to be an entertainer. It actually has saved his life playing music. Welcome to America's Got Talent. What's your name? I'm Cody. I mean, he is the most remarkable person. And his mum is the most amazing person. I have a different perspective now, what she's gone through and what he's gone through, than to see this moment at his age when he wins one of the biggest shows in the world. Winner of the one million dollars is... For the very first time ever, a world's first premiere by an extremely talented young singer and pianist, I'm proud to present to you, Cody Lee. Imagine there's no heaven It's easy if you try No hell below us Above us only sky Imagine all the people Living for today ah, Imagine there's no countries Isn't hard to do Nothing to kill or die for And no religion too Imagine all the people living life in peace. You, you may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not the only one. I hope someday you join us. And the world will be as one Imagine no possessions I wonder if you can No need for greed or hunger A brotherhood of man Imagine all the people sharing all the world. You, you may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not the only one. I hope someday you join us. 
and the world will live this one. Just stop your crying at the sign of the times Welcome to the final show You hope you're wearing your best clothes You can't bright the door on your way to the sky You look pretty good down here But you ain't really good We never done, we've been here before Why are we always stuck and running from the bullets? The bullets We never done, we've been here before Why are we always stuck and running from the bullets? The bullets We don't talk enough We should open up Before it's all too much Oh, 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 oh. Will we ever learn? We've been here before It's just what we know Stop your crying, baby, it's a sign of the times We gotta get away We got to 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 get away We got to, we got to get away We got to, we got to get away We got to, we got to get away Just stop your crying, it's a sign of a time What a captivating performance that was! Well, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together one more time for Cody Lee. Without further delay, let's commence the next category, the service and solution category. This category recognizes services and solution providers with the measurement parameters of innovation distinction, problem solving solutions, replicability and an institutional support with a measurable result. So let's begin. And with the winners of the service and solution category in the IIA 2020 in alphabetical order of their company names are First, may we present to you Advance International Sinjurian Burhat from Malaysia with their service and solution. Most impactful agricultural innovations on global food assurance. Let's have a look at this video.
Data Company Limited from Taiwan with their service and solution. Artificial intelligence drives retail. Let's have a look once again. China Three Gorges Brazil from Brazil with their service and solution, Macrofights Monitoring System and Solution. Let's take a look at their video showcase. No ano de 2017, um grande volume de macrófitas desceu o reservatório e acabou ocasionando o desligamento parcial da, da usina. A quantidade de macrófitas que se acumulam nas grades é tão grande que ocasiona o desprendimento dessas grades e engolimento delas para dentro das turbinas. O projeto ele visa o desenvolvimento de um sistema computacional e o papel fundamental desse sistema é apoiar o time de operação a prever algumas situações. Um sistema totalmente automatizado, a partir do download periódico de imagens orbitais de satélites gratuitas para o monitoramento de macrófitas aquáticas em reservatórios. Então, prever quando pode haver um deslocamento de um banco de macrófitas, o tempo desse deslocamento até a usina, o fluxo, a direção de deslocamento e algumas outras características físicas e até ambientais. Esse projeto inicia uma nova forma de encarar um dos problemas que acompanha a usina desde a sua entrada em operação. Up next is Dubai Electricity and Water Authority from United Arab Emirates with their service and solution, Durub GIS Field Mobile Solution. The Durub GIS Field Mobile Solution provides an exclusive access to digital maps of the Dubai Electricity and Water Authority network assets. It provides real-time GIS maps and allows field employees to navigate cables pipelines, stations, and others to ensure efficiency and safety. This mobile solution replaces paper maps and has improved productivity six times faster before being introduced. Triumphant in the same category is Dubai Electricity and Water Authority from United Arab Emirates with their service and solution, Ramas Virtual Agent. The Ramas Virtual Agent is an artificial intelligence powered bot that is designed to support the Dubai Electricity and Water Authority's customer service in multiple languages. As it uses AI, the 24-7 Virtual Agent has the ability to learn from every interaction, ensuring its services improve constantly to deliver excellent customer experience. Eurasia Tunnel from Turkey with their service and solution, speed regulating moving lighting, pacemaker lighting technology. Let's take a look.
we have John Solar Energy Company Limited from Thailand with their service and solution, one-stop EPC service and solution for the solar industry. John Solar Energy Company Limited is an expert in solar business providing one-stop service including design engineering, installation and construction, and operation and maintenance. The company focuses on solar PV rooftop, solar farm, and floating solar for both commercial and industrial customer segments. While being very selective in products used in every project and aims to deliver the highest quality of service to its customers. Next up, we have Medi Data Solutions International Asia Pacific Private Limited from Singapore. For their service and solution, My Medi Data, the industry's first patient portal platform. Let's have a look at this video. This year, we built My Medi Data as a new technology in the patient cloud platform of tools made to simplify clinical trials for patients. My Metadata is supported by the entire Rave family of products and the Rave Metadata platform of tools, and it provides a single user interface for patients to engage with clinical research trials before they've joined a study, all throughout the study, and even after the trial is over. Bringing the traditional patient cloud product line like ECOA, eConsent, virtual trials, and wearable sensors into My Metadata is our first priority. My Metadata also will have brand new features we've never supported before at Metadata, like virtual visits. The new functionality for this, called My Metadata Live, is being released in 2020 and provides sites and patients a way to engage remotely during COVID or other situations where patient burden is too high to make site visits. Another winner from Thailand, we have Metropolitan Waterworks Authority Thailand with their service and solution anti-salinity tools. Metropolitan Waterworks Authority or MWA was facing problems with seawater contamination in raw water, resulting in the increase of salinity in water supply. Thus, MWA invented anti-salinity tools and set which is a salinity prediction system for planning and pumping raw water at an appropriate salinity level into raw water canals. Therefore, MWA can supply a clean and safe tap water with the quality and specified standards to customers. Next up, we have Nuti Food Nutrition Food Joint Stock Company from Vietnam with their service and solution. Nuti Food Nutrition Research Institute Sweden or NNRIS. Let's take a look at their video. Moving on is Prince Bank Public Limited Company from Cambodia with their service and solution HR in Pocket. So let's have a look at their video.
is Rizal Commercial Banking Corporation, RCBC, from the Philippines with their service and solution, Best Digital Inclusion Initiative. RCBC is honored to have received the 2020 Best Digital Inclusion Award for this card deck. Bagging this accolade from the prestigious International Innovations Award is a recognition of our collective aspiration to further promote and accelerate inclusive digital finance in the Philippines. On behalf of our chairperson, Helen Luchenko D, our president and CEO, Eugene S. Acevedo, and the men and women of RCBC, thank you. This is for every empowered and digitally enabled Filipino. Mabuhay! Sai Gong Tuong Tin Commercial Joint Stock Bank, Sakong Bank from Vietnam and their service and solution, Sakong Bank Digitalization Strategy. Let's take a look at their video. Bản chất của các mối quan hệ đều là những bài học Khởi đầu cùng hôn nhân Gắn kết cùng gia đình Ươm mầm cùng con trẻ Con đi học nha con Trưởng thành cùng tình bạn Thăng hoa cùng tình yêu Phát triển cùng cộng sự Cạnh tranh cùng đối thủ Song hành cùng đối tác để vươn đến thành công Chúng ta cùng nhau học và dành những bài học cho nhau Sacombank đồng hành cùng phát triển Finally, last but not least, let's hear it for YouGov from Singapore with their service and solution, YouGov Direct. YouGov Direct is an innovation in the world of marketing, allowing advertisers to know who it is they're, they're reaching, allowing consumers to give up their data in a way that's permissioned and paid for, allowing publishers to get more value out of their real estate. It changes the model. At one level, it's a research tool, and then we hope it'll become a mass market advertising tool. People can download an app where they give the information that they want advertisers to have, and then receive the advertising on that app and get paid for it. The advertiser has an investment in that particular contact. They're not just sending it out to everybody, they're paying you to listen, and in return, you have an advert in front of you in your app that you have to interact with by answering some questions. We think this will benefit everybody that's involved in advertising. It is to change the relationships in advertising. It is to let you target, but in a way that people want to be targeted. Congratulations to all the service and solution category winners. And you know what? Let's give a big thumbs up to all our winners in the live chat box. Moving on to the final awards presentation, the next category is Organization and Culture Category. Our award recipients for the Organization and Culture Category stands for their impact and sustainability, replicability, institutional support and with measurable results. The recipients of the IIA 2020 Organization and Culture category in alphabetical order are Starting off with AIA International Limited Taiwan branch from Taiwan with their Organization and Culture. Real ambition brought to life. So let's take a look at this video. Gong Tong Chuang Zhao Yi Ge Gong Hao 
共享共荣的环境，也可以觉得他是非常呃引以为傲的，在这家公司上班。信做对的事，用对的方法，与对的人工作，会带来好的一个成就。International Markets Global Innovation Team from Belgium. Their organization and culture, Signa Innovation Catalyst. Signa's Innovation Catalyst program is an internal employee engagement initiative focused on accelerating innovation across Signa's international markets: Europe, the Middle East, Africa, Asia Pacific, and North America. The catalysts were trained in design thinking methods to learn the skills and mindsets in order to implement a range of innovative frameworks during which they had the opportunity to work on real world challenges in collaboration with senior leaders from across the business. Our final winner of the category is K11 Concepts Limited from Hong Kong with their organization and culture K11 Retail Digitalization Strategy. Let's have a look. Our social mission here is to build a Silicon Valley of culture to enrich consumers' daily lives through uh, the power of innovation, culture, and also creativity. Idea Museo is to bring the best in class from around the world, the most innovative retail, curated in one place. We have designed a lot of different pavilions and features. We have also combined some new tech and craftsmanship. We hope to bring different experiences to the audience. The new Hong Kong waterfront with K11 as its centerpiece will be a new uh, world-class cultural destination. Congratulations to all the winners in the organization and culture category. And don't forget to give this live award ceremony a huge like if you're streaming from Enterprise Asia's YouTube channel. Ladies and gentlemen, the International Innovation Awards 2020 has come to an end. And once again, we would like to thank all our partners, starting with the Australian Chamber of Commerce in Vietnam. British Chamber of Commerce, Singapore. Malaysian Chamber of Commerce, Hong Kong and Macau Limited. Malaysian Investment Development Authority. National Institute of Entrepreneurship and Innovation, Cambodia. Singapore Business Federation. Singapore National Employers Federation. Singapore Indian Chamber of Commerce and Industry. Singapore Malay Chamber of Commerce and Industry. Avangardia Group, Sindirian Berhad, the official production partner. And of course, a big thank you to our media partners. PR Newswire, IIA's news release distribution partner. Asian NGO. Business World, the Philippines. Commercial Times, Taiwan. Esquire, Philippines. Hong Kong Economic Times. Kumparan, Indonesia. SME Magazine, The Asian Entrepreneur, The Nation, Thailand. Last but not least, congratulations to all our award recipients. Innovation is the key to growth. And while we may be all in different countries, different cities, different time zones, we are all united in the belief that we can individually contribute to the world innovatively. Innovation is how we survive and thrive 
moving forward. And until we physically see each other next year, stay safe and continue the good work that you have done thus far. Once again, thank you very much for joining us this evening. My name is Nadia Heng, wishing you all the very best of luck in your endeavors and have a wonderful evening ahead. I'll see you all again next year.